We are readying for our very first Flag Day celebration here at Marathon School. It's a center tradition, 25 plus years that we've carried over to our new home and we are thrilled to be hosting this um, annual event at our new location. So uh, what kind of things can we see today? You're going to see children in our flag colors, red, white and blue, singing, waving flags. You might get a tear in your eye because it's going to touch your heart. Um, just the joy and innocence of children uh, appreciating the flag is, is truly moving. We have our honor guard who has been at Center School for many, many years. They are here again presenting the colors and we're thrilled that they're still able to, in their busy schedules, they're quite busy, uh, make time for us. So, uh, since we don't have a car to march around, what, what are, we, are they going to march today? Yes, weather is in our favor. Thank goodness the spring's been quite difficult. We will march along the sidewalks of our school. We are fortunate that now at our new building, we have sidewalks around our school. We will have parents line the sidewalks. Children will be able to march and wave their flags in the sunshine. When I was here, I initiated the program and uh, we, we started a tradition and they've upheld it ever since. And Lauren, the new principal, invited me to come back. It was a very, very surprising and pleasing invitation. And uh, so you started this, uh, we were talking earlier, but there was a little story on how you got the program started 25 years ago. Oh, we, I went down to the cemetery in Natick and asked the caretaker if he could get me 750 flags after Memorial Day that they took off the veterans' graves. They were gonna burn them. So they, uh, they, uh, they collected 750 and I gave every teacher 25. That's how we started the kids marching in to the, to the uh, Marines hymn and the Army Quezon song. And uh, the kids used to love it because they were marching. 
That's us there. Now you saw today's festivities a little bit different than Seder because we don't have a, a common to match on. So what did you think about today's festivities? How your program has grown? I think it's phenomenal. I think the kids did a phenomenal job. The teachers can be proud of the kids because they entered the auditorium beautifully and they left beautifully. And they, they uh, I think this is a program that will live with the kids for their entire lifetime.